tell you something about my company, Kaiser Italia. As Alberto said before, uh, Kaiser Italia is working in uh, aerospace. So let me begin telling you how you feel when you uh, work in a space company. Well, there is three, three people, three men that have the same work. But when you ask them, what is your work? They answer you in different way. The first said, I'm breaking rocks. Second, I'm my life. But third, said, I'm helping to build a cathedral. And this is how you can feel working in space company. So Kaiser Italia is a small independent uh, engineering company. We are incorporated in 1986. We are in Livorno, in Tuscany, and up to date, we have a record of 53 uh, missions in space with more than 82 payloads. So, what is space? We participate on sounding balloon. Uh, obviously, we had some tests on some robotic flight, but uh, space is the outer space, out, uh, out of the earth with sounding rocket, Russian satellite, obviously shuttle, uh, bus, and uh, now on the ISS and from 2011 with the Chinese with Shenzhou. This is our track of record and uh, we are able to act as a sub uh, to other uh, industry, but we are also a prime contractor of the Space National uh, Agency. And this is uh, my company. As you can see, uh, the company in the company, uh, yeah, in this picture, there is the crew of the STS-120 uh, that visiting our, uh, our facilities. And uh, there are 45 uh, of us and uh, we have deep expertise in physics, in uh, electronic engineer, in aeronautic engineer, in uh, informatic, and uh, also we have all the facilities to perform and to uh, build up and to develop a space system. We are uh, certified by ISO standard and moreover, all the that uh, have manufactured our system are qualified uh, by ESA approved institution. Our customer, uh, we work directly for space agency, so European Space Agency, Garden Space Agency, but we work also with the big company in Europe. Our technical know-how. Well, we are um, doing systems that perform scientific experiment in microgravity. So we uh, design and develop all the uh, electrical hardware and software for flight hardware and ground hardware and software and even design the uh, mechanical, the optical to form all the tests and even the ground support. But we are uh, very active in uh, the biology facilities. Up to now, uh, a remarkable number of experiment hardware was developed uh, for the investigation from cell sculpture, uh, yes, uh, little animal, and uh, even on uh, physiology. Moreover, when you have to do biology in space, you have to upload and download samples to the ISS. And this is performed uh, via uh, ECHO. ECHO is 
ESA collision container. Uh, it's a system, uh, it's a passive temperature control transportation system that uh, is used uh, and it, that is uh, designed by Kaiser and is developed by Kaiser uh, and that uh, allow to upload and download by the samples on the ISS. But let's go further. We talk about biology. But uh, we are uh, develop also system that uh, is used for study in physiology. One of these is HPA, is a system for the measurement of movement of the upper limb. Uh, it consists of a glove, an instrumented glove, a dynamometer that measure the strength uh, of the upper limb and uh, all the uh, position of the finger. Another uh, facility is Elite S2, uh, is for the total body Boston analysis. It is delivered to NASA in 2006 and it is used uh, during uh, four increments in the uh, international station. It composed of four camera and uh, it has the possibility to trace Movement of the in With Elite, we are also a user support and control uh, center. So we have the possibility to receive directly from NASA the uh, video from the camera, and we have voice loop uh, with the SRAN when they are for uh, our spur. And we are able to collect data directly and to distribute to the scientists. But let's come to the technologists. One of our technologies is uh, tensegrity. is uh, a study, study uh, to um, develop a deployable structure, uh, tensegrity is a deployable structure. It means that you have no joint so it is. Uh, it could be used for uh, the development of large container. Some uh, facilities that is uh, now on uh, ongoing. We are uh, now at the end of phase B of FIBO. Uh, FIBO is an external facility for the ESS. Uh, that allow the execution of experiment in uh, various, uh, uh, in a lot of field, and radiobiology, exobiology, and so on. Uh, FIBO was selected uh, by the Italian Space Agency as one of the two uh, opportunity mission, and uh, now we are uh, at the end of phase B, and we want to go on, I think that uh, even here in uh, NASA there is uh, some interest in the uh, form experiment in this uh, field. Another is uh, with us, uh, is a minimum monitorized automatic system for uh, sample analysis. Uh, this is uh, useful in ISS, but it could be used also uh, in uh, an hospital to uh, analyze if uh, there is some uh, problem in, in, the, in the area. So let me go to the conclusion. We want to move forward, we want to move on, but as Albert Einstein said, life is like riding a bicycle. If you want to stay in balance, you have to move. But remember, sometimes it's not enough. <laughs> Thank you.